Hey, this is Brett. Hope everybody's having a great day out there today. And I am extremely excited to go over this ultra clean, very rare 2013 Ford Shelby GT500 Mustang. This is stock number 14861Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used high horsepower sports car headquarters. This 2013 Ford Shelby GT500 has the 5.8 liter supercharged V8 Trinity engine, puts out 662 horsepower, 631 foot-pounds of torque, and it's paired up with the six-speed manual transmission, 13 and 14, were the last years you could get the GT500 with the stick shift transmission. This is this car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and it is 100% ready to go. This is a one owner, clean title history, clean Carfax out of Florida. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video. We're gonna go over all the build numbers on this one. I'm gonna show you all the options, go inside, start it up, take a look under the hood and just give you the most accurate representation that I can of this car. This one, as you can see, has the very rare glass roof option. There was only 53 of these in race red made with the glass roof. And in 14, there was only 57. So only 110 race red glass roofs with the 5.8 Trinity engine are out there. Um, and if you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day and have access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube and stay current on our ever-changing and vast sports car inventory so you do not miss out on gems like this one. And this one does have the SVT performance package which gives you the 19-inch painted alloy wheels in the front and the Brembo brakes. This one has Michelin Pilot Super Sport tires in the front. These are 275-35ZR19s and I would say they have 80 to 90, 95% of the tread left on them. Very good tread left on those tires. And you can see the front fender and the white stripes are in excellent condition. The Cobra logo is in nice shape as well. I didn't see any dents or dings, scuffs or scrapes or scratches on that front fender. It does have the HID headlamps and the LED running lights, the factory fog lights and the lower valence are, is absolutely perfect. And you may be wondering if you follow the channel why I'm doing another video on this car. It's because we did replace these lower valences in our safety inspection so they are brand new no scratches on them and very very nice and you can see these stripes are all in very nice condition as well and this is one of 175 in race red that came with the white stripes for 2013 so that's a pretty low build number as well. The hood is in fantastic condition, no dents or dings on there and no corrosion. Like I said, this is a one owner clean title history out of uh, Florida and it's a clean Carfax passenger side front fender is in very nice condition as well. And this passenger side front wheel, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. Now, as you go down this side of this 2013 Ford Shelby GT500, make note of how clean the body is. No dents, no dings, no scuffs, no scrapes, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is, no scratches. Very, very nice car, very low miles on this one as well. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away or even if you're close by, you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the car hear the car and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at and see those stripes are absolutely perfect on the side. And if this video helps you make a smart buying decision or just make the decision to come take a look at the car, let your salesman know what you saw the video is helpful and that Brett sent you back wheels absolutely perfect as well. These are 20s in the back. And we have the same styled tires, but these are 295 35 ZR20s. And you can see just how much tread is, are on those. And uh, I can show you under here, and I wanna point out the rear diff. It has the cooler line that's coming off of it. That's really the only way to tell if your car has the track pack or not. And if it has that cooler line, it has the track pack. So this one definitely does have the track pack. 
And if you want to see more pictures of the underbody on this car, I got a link in the description below on YouTube to our website with probably about 10 photos of the underbody, which is very, very clean as well. The rear bumper is absolutely perfect. No dents, stings, scuffs, or scrapes. Have the rear diffuser, the quad tip, dual rear exhaust, and uh, the stripes back here are in fantastic condition. No scuffs or scrapes on that rear fascia. You get the GT500 logo there. Let's look inside the trunk here. You get the LED tail lamps that are sequential when you've got your turn signal on. So back here, I got all the goodies. We have the original um, car cover that came with this vehicle. This was one of 175 that came with the car cover and in race red. Here is your Shelby American Vehicle Authenticity Certificate. And then this is a cool one from FordShowParts.com. Uh, you got your build on this one. This is a limited edition and it was built on 710 of 2012. The vehicle is number 954 of 4,077 coupes built and number 87 of 346 made in race red. So here's the original window sticker. Feel free to pause this. You can see it has the SVT performance package, which is 3,495 bucks. The SVT track package, which is 2,995. The electronics package, which is 2,340. Glass roof, which is $1,995. And uh, the car cover was 375. Total MSRP on this car was 66,195. And there is the mileage right there. And if you want to get your price, it's in the description below. If you're not on our website, it's in, on YouTube. It's in the description below. The price and miles and everything, all the information on this car. Safety ratings, very good. Here's a build sheet. So uh, basically, this will come with the car. And I have all the options right here. So 4,077 coupes, 346 were race red. 60 came with the charcoal and white striped seats, which are right here, and you can see 66. And 216 had the track pack, 231 had the electronics package, um, and here is the track pack right there, 216. And 53 had the glass roof, 57 had glass roofs, and 14 and 110 total. 284 had the performance package, 175 had the white stripes and car cover. So cool information to know that's all going to be with the car when you come to purchase it. There's um, aftermarket intake in here as well. And underneath here is tire inflator kit. And yeah, very nice and clean back there. And there's the original hood prop. Trunk shuts nice and solidly, no dents or dings on there. And coming around to the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side. Very, very nice. This back wheel is in excellent shape as well. No scuffs or scrapes on there. It even has the Shelby valve stem covers. I got those on mine. And you get the capless fuel fill there. And down the rest of the side of the car, the door, and stripe is in excellent condition. Very nice. Oh, rockers are in pretty nice shape as well. And you do get the power mirrors with the blind spot mirrors. Inside you get the black and white striped, I guess, standard seats. Got a little bit of Alcantara suede on the bolsters there. You get the Cobra embossed on the backrest, side curtain airbags. And you can see the bolsters in really nice shape. Power driver seat with lumbar. And you get the factory floor mat here. So this one is the 20th anniversary, which is this sill is really one of the only ways you can decipher between a 13 and a 14. This one says 20th anniversary and the other one just says SVT, I believe. You get the auto headlamps, launch control, your dampers and your different steering feels, power windows, locks and mirrors. This is an American car, no Canadian cars here. Tire and loading information sticker. I'll take a quick look at the back seats. They are in fantastic condition. Smells very clean inside this car. I don't think it's been smoked in. 
Let's hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything this one has to offer on the interior. Yeah, it definitely smells like a GT500 in here. 3,972 miles on it. Instrument cluster is very clean. And you get the leather and suede wrapped steering wheel, Bluetooth and audio controls on the right, uh, cruise controls and information center controls on the left. You get the Cobra logo on there in the center and the steering wheels in fantastic condition. No excessive wear, rips or tears on there. This is the touchscreen radio. This is the Sync 1 system. Um, it does have the factory navigation system. This is the uh, same radio I got in my car. And uh, you can see there's Highway 41, so that is working nicely. You also get AM, FM, and Sirius satellite radio capabilities. The reason I like this radio so much is because it still has a CD player, and you get a jukebox where you can burn music to the uh, hard drive from that CD player, so you can have all your CDs in the jukebox and you never have to bring them along with you, which is really cool. Um, so really nice radio. And down here, your climate controls, volume and tune controls, dual climate controls. Now you can do your climate up here on the radio as well. Uh, you get the six speed manual transmission with the cue ball shifter there. Stability control, hazard lights, trunk popper, sync for your Bluetooth. This one does have the ambient lighting with the color change in the cup holders. It also changes color underneath the uh, dash there. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition. No rips or tears on there. And there is the coveted glass roof. Everybody wants one, but they are very rare, very hard to find. Home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems and map lights right there. It does have the sun shade. And this one works pretty good. It does go back. It binds just a little bit, but for the most part, it goes back nice and smooth and uh, very nice there. All right, I'm going to start it up. And we're going to take a look under the hood. We're also going to listen to that exhaust. I've been told to start it up and give you a good startup sound. So the only way I can do that is like this. You can see it starts up. No check engine lights or anything like that. I'll close the door and put the brake off. Um, but starts right up. No check engine lights. Let's go listen to the exhaust a little bit and then we'll take a look under the hood. And next to the Hellcat exhaust, this is probably my favorite, second favorite. Sounds really good. Love those LED tail lamps. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today, hopefully from this HD video. You've been able to verify the quality, condition, options, cleanliness, rarity, and just overall looks of this car. And hopefully you enjoyed it as well. I love doing these videos, even though I did this one twice. HID headlamps are very bright. And under the hood, we have the 5.8 liter supercharged Trinity V8 engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. 662 horsepower, 631 foot pounds of torque. You can see it does have a JLT performance intake there, and a, it looks like a KN filter on there too. But uh, this one was hand built at the Romeo Niche line by Keith Bristock and Anne LeMay. Love those powder coated blue heads. And once again, this car has been fully safety and inspected as a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. It is 100% ready to go. Has a red line tuning um, shocks on there, which are doing a nice job holding that hood up. There is the emissions sticker. And this car is 100% ready to go. I would highly recommend it from a quality and condition standpoint. I would ship this car anywhere to Florida, California, Texas, New York. Whoever's going to get this car is going to absolutely love it. 
one of the nicest GT500s we've ever had, one of the rarest with the glass roof, and uh, just a really, really good looking car. And like I said, if you want to see more pictures of this car, you can click the link in the description below, or you can go to that website and search for the stock number 14861Z, uh, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle we have, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day. And have access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and GT500 walk arounds on YouTube. And stay current on our ever changing and vast GT500 inventory so you do not miss out on gems like this car. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the GT500 videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to be offering this ultra clean, ultra rare, very good looking nicely loaded 2013 Shelby GT500 in race red clear coat with the glass roof. Thank you so much for checking out the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks again and have a great day.